Good evening. Today is still Thursday, April 18th, 2024. And I'm dropping off my paperwork again. And guess what I do when I'm dropping my paperwork off? Sometimes. I make a video. Only when something is on my mind. I'm always, uh, this is like a business now. I have to grind. I have to work to achieve what I want. So that's what I'm doing. Now, sometimes I may not have an idea or whatever, so I won't post. If I have an idea, I'm going to post. I got an idea, right? On my way over here, I was looking at a, a, a reel, right? First of all, thank y'all for tuning in. My bad. Sorry about that. I was looking at a reel with Russell Wilson and Sierra. It was like a, it was asking each other a question and answer type little game they was playing, right? And Russell asked her, does she know what his greatest fear is, right? He asked her, do you know what my greatest fear is? And she was like, uh, not being prepared, uh, losing your career or whatever, you know what I mean? All the things as a woman, she knows what should be a man's biggest fear. As a woman, she answering the question the right way, the way he should have answered it. He asked her, the woman, his wife, what is his biggest fear? She gave the right answer. Losing his career or not being prepared for his career. That's what she said. And she was correct. As a woman, not even being a man, she knows what she wants in a man and what a man should be focused on as a man. The woman knows what that man should be focused on as a man, even though she's a woman. She knows what type of man she wants. She knows what she wants in a man, right? So her answer to the question was, his biggest fear is not being prepared, losing his career. That was the correct answer that she gave. He said no. She started laughing more. She was surprised. Like, that's not what? Hold on, y'all. Yeah, he uh he said his biggest fear is losing her. Wrong answer. And I'm going to tell you why. Now, I'm not a Russell Wilson hater. I'm not a guy that's hating on Russell Wilson. As a matter of fact, overall, as a guy, as a man, I rate him very high. As a quality man. Solid overall dude. Not a troublemaker. Not an a-hole. Good all around solid dude. Good dude. When I say don't be like Russell Wilson, I'm not talking about all the other areas of Russell Wilson life. Because the other areas of his life, that's a good way to be. Career wise, type of man he is, I admire him for everything else. But despite all that, that mindset he got can cost him everything else he got over here that's going good. Everything else that's good about it can be destroyed because of that mindset right there, the way his biggest fear is losing a woman. Here is man. We all know who Russell Wilson is, how successful he is. A lot of y'all going to go hard on him because he being a stepfather. That's not why I'm tripping. The stepfather part don't bother me. I've been a stepfather. 
it's a thankless job, but hey, a man that can step up like that, I ain't got no, I got respect for that. Y'all may not as God see that like I see it. So that ain't my issue with Russell Wilson. In fact, he's a stepfather. And what he's doing with future son and what have you, what a lot of people give him hassle for. I don't have a tr problem with him not being a street dude. He's not a real N-word. He's not a hood dude. He's not this, that, and the other. He's not gangster. He's square. He did see that. I ain't got a problem with none of that. When I say don't be like Russell Wilson, I'm not talking about that. Like, don't be a square. I want my son to be a square. I wouldn't mind my son being like Russell Wilson in every other area except that one. When he said losing his wife and his woman is his biggest fear. Her leaving him is his biggest fear. Even his own woman didn't guess that answer. Because she knows that ain't the right answer, play, uh, player. And any of you women that gonna come for me saying, what, what's wrong with a man loving his wife? Ain't nothing wrong with a man loving his wife. But I'm gonna tell you something, women. A man who thinks losing you is his biggest fear, you don't want that man. That man is dangerous to himself and to you. I'm telling you what I know. The majority of domestic problems that ends up with a man doing something terrible to, you know, like when a woman say, I'm out of here, she gone, and he can't, he ain't, he ain't having that. That's a man whose biggest fear is losing that woman. The same man that y'all turn around and hate because I can't believe he did that to her. That's that type of man. Long as everything good. Oh, he just loves her. Oh, look how he just adores her. He worships the ground she walks on. That's what y'all be saying when everything good. But for whatever reason, that woman decides she can't take it unless she's ready to go. No, she ain't. No, she, oh, she ain't going nowhere. If you got a man who you are who losing you is his biggest fear, you got a problem on your hands, sister. It is not cute. That is not what you want in a man. If your man's biggest fear ain't losing his career and his ability to provide for you and his family, if that ain't his biggest fear, you got a problem on your hands and you don't even know it. You think it's cute. You think you living in a fairy tale world. Your prince, oh, he's a prince and my, I'm his princess. You're not living in reality. Any woman that don't understand what I'm saying, you don't know a woman or seen a woman who's been, I can't say the words on here, you know, by a man that wouldn't let her go. The type of man that ain't gonna let you go, the type of man say, you, if you ain't gonna be with me, you ain't gonna be with nobody, that's the man whose biggest fear is losing you. You don't want a man like Russell Wilson. You think you do. Now, you might want a rich man. I get that. I'm more power to you. I ain't got no problem with that as a woman. I, I, I understand you want a rich man, a wealthy man, a man that can provide a lifestyle for you, where you, you, can, you know, a lifestyle of comfort and abundance. I, hey, I ain't mad at you for wanting that. But the other stuff Russell Wilson got going on, where he worshiping Sierra, he put up on a pedestal, losing her is his biggest fear. That ain't what you want with uh, women. You might not like big boy. You might hate me because some of the stuff I say because I keep it real with y'all. I don't sugarcoat nothing. I don't pander to you even though some men say I do. And y'all say I pander to the men. So pick my poison. I got, I'm got. i a pander to some goddamn body one way or other. Russell Wilson is not what you should be looking for in a man as far as his mindset towards women. 
Career-wise, yes. Father-wise, yes. Overall character as a man, yes. But that one thing, that one little, that one little issue right there can throw a monkey wrench and everything else good about it. There are people who have lived an outstanding, upstanding life all their lives. Been great people, never hurt nobody, always been good, always did the right thing. And one split second wrong decision took down all that. One bad decision took out everything they ever done right. So no matter how good it may seem like Russell Wilson is as a man, a person, future stepfather, blah, blah, blah. He's a stand-up guy, great career, college. I'm sorry, he's just an all-around stand-up guy. It can take one thing to make y'all look at him in a total different light. The fact that his biggest fear is losing his wife and God forbid one day she want to leave. And that's his biggest fear, which is losing her. How you think he's gonna react to that? Can we say OJ? I'm just saying. Before he did that, who saw that coming? We were all in awe and shock. Is this really going on? Yes. Someone in OJ's position who had all that going for him because if he couldn't have her, nobody else could. It happens, y'all. Don't be like Russell Wilson. Ladies, don't get you a man whose biggest fear is losing you. You do not want that. I promise you, you don't. It sounds good, you know, romantic, cool. Oh, they just look so good together. And you might say, with big gorge, you hating on Russell Wilson. So be it. Go get you one then. Go get you a man whose biggest fear is losing you. Instead of his biggest fear should be losing his ability to earn an income. That's my biggest fear. And my child. Everything else we can deal with. The well-being of my child and losing my ability to support myself and my family. That should be a man's biggest fear, not his woman leaving him. A man should have a mindset to know that, hey, I'm up a level. She leave me, I can get another one. He ain't got that mindset. You ain't got yourself none of the man alone. Let all the other what they call it, that other, that other stuff is window dressing. Good job, good career, pay all the bills, take good care of you, known around town, NFL superstar, whatever. All that window dressing. That's disguising something on the inside that could turn out to bite you in your butt later on. If for some reason it don't work out and you got a man whose biggest fear is losing you. And guess what? He ain't going to lose you. Even if you want to go. Guess what? He ain't going to lose you. Even if you want to go. So you can say Big Wall hating on Russell Wilson all you want. Those who know, know. You know where I'm coming from. You probably got a family member, a, a, a woman or something that's done been through a situation with a man like that whose biggest fear was losing that woman. And you ended up losing your family member because of that old psychotic thinking man. That is not normal. That is not how a man is supposed to feel. That is not how a man is supposed to think. Not a strong man. I'm going to put you on truth. Hold on, y'all. So y'all can label this as a hating Russell Wilson video, or you can label it as, damn, Big Ward, I ain't think about it that way. You're right. The choice is yours. Get it? Got it? Good.
Bye.